Lucy. Uh, Jen asked me to help out, and at the time she asked me, I didn't realize it would mean that I would be the last person standing and standing between you and the parking lot. So thank you very much, Jen, uh, for that. I appreciate that. But I do actually have a, just a couple things to do, a couple important things to do. And we would really like to thank the few folks who did a lot of work for today. So I would ask that uh, Judge Brzee, if you can come back up here, and Colin, if you can come back up here. Uh, let's thank Judge Brzee, first of all, for being the MC at 7.30 a.m. in the morning and getting people away. So thank you very much, thank you, Judge Brzee. And Colin, who six months ago, the board brainstormed who would be the best choice for a speaker. And, and Colin was our dream choice. And so we're so happy to have him. You can do a great job today, guys. Okay. We wanted to, Marie Rodriguez left, but let's give a round of applause. It was great to have a parent. That's why we do this, right? And I would like to ask every single PCRC staff member to stand up. I know some of you are shy, so pull out their seats. They can be next to them. They either stand up or fall down. They, they are the, the lynch tape, the key that makes everything happen. And as Warren was saying, those are, they are the ones that work with the staff. And we as a board are happy to support them. So thank you. Thank you very much. And really, the, the last thing I want to say is, um, uh, just for your information, some of you may know, I'm a professor at Hastings Law School and director for their Center for Negotiation and Dispute Resolution. Uh, like Colin, I, I've devoted my life and my career to dispute resolution. And why, you know, why do I spend what little free time I have on PCRC? It's the place where I contribute. It's, it's a place that, that matters to me. Um, because I, I've been a first-hand witness to the, the magic of mediation, you know, the fantastic outcomes of facilitation. And it's because it's people bringing people together for the common good. Right? That's, that's what it's about. So I, I'm hooked, too. I'm hooked as a mediator when I see crotchety union folks hugging management. You know? I'm, I'm hooked as a teacher when I see students light up because they're so excited to talk about their, their next negotiation. And that's exactly why PCRC matters. You know, if you care about reducing adversarialism in society, increasing collaboration, and as, as was said earlier, community dispute resolution is where it happens, right? Citizens in our society, they experience that magic, they experience those fantastic outcomes because they're coming to places like PCRC. And, and I've had a chance to talk to folks from all over the country, uh, people from Community Dispute Resolution Centers, and, and I know this is of a lot of bias, but this is one of the finest Community Dispute Resolution Centers in the country. In the country. I know that's very biased, but that's the truth. But we all face challenges, right? There's, a city, there's the challenges of city budgets, the challenges of school budgets. Uh, state funding is a contradiction in terms, basically, right? <laughs> at, at, at this point. Um, but what, what can we do? So we are very fortunate to have an event like this. I want to thank you. You're the ones who make PCRC possible, you here today. So I'd like to thank you all very much. And, as Warren said, we do need a little bit more help, and I do feel like the announcer on KQED, the pledge drive, right? $40 with $12 a month, that's just 40 cents a day. Isn't PCRC worth 40 cents a day? Right? But, but if you can, please do pick up those envelopes. If you're new to PCRC, please do talk to staff, sign up for the newsletter. For those of you who have been longtime friends of PCRC, we want to continue to build that relationship. And that's pretty much it. I hope you've had a great time. We'll see you next year, if not sooner. Take care.